Good grief, what's going on here? We did praise a bit too much on there, didn't we? Let's try that again. See what happens. So my Game of Thrones mm. Hopefully it's not going to start kicking off again today But you never know. You never know. So, my son started playing Farming Simulator 2019 last night, ready for 2020. It's quite interesting. It's having a look at that. Um, people are also playing Age of Empires 4. Did the cows come home? Which seems interesting as well. These are all people who have got, like, Game Pass. I suppose it's pretty good good value is it seven pound or something a month from microsoft i just haven't got that amount of time to play games really i feel like occupation you know it's hardly going to be game player is it so I suppose all the people now could be saying, oh, well, at this stage, you could be walking around your ship. Yeah, but doing what exactly? You know, that's my point of view. I'm not really a big fan. The interiors would be there. But unless you're going to put gameplay into that with multiplayer, with multi-crew, then that would be great. So if I was flying... And Simon was there, for example, and we took a bit of damage. And I'd say, Simon, go fix the deflector shield. And off Simon would go down into the bowels of the ship to fix the deflector shields and come all the way back up. That would be semi. But can you imagine doing that by yourself whilst still trying not to get shot? You couldn't do it. And even if you had other, uh, yeah, bang in your head and all that. And, e and even, if, even if you had, you know, the NPC crew like that like you have for the fighters you're not going to trust them with your ship are you no one's going to trust them with your ship <laughs> it's not in my job description chief yeah <laughs> oh there's a lot of adding work at the moment but it's a good point you know what are you to do? You know? So here we are. Lovely. You know? What more do you need inside a good old python? Not much. I mean, you've got fleet carrier interiors. Great, you know. Um, and I think all this here was probably more to do with with VR than anything else. Exactly. Exactly. Because you want to be flying the ship. That's the whole point of Elite. Elite want... You want... It. In essence, it's you in your ship flying around being a lone wolf in the galaxy. Right? Now, we've had an awful lot of fun multiplayer. Great. And, it, and it's good. But in essence, that's what the game is. 
Exactly. Everybody wants to be the man in the chair. Well, let's face it, I am the red shirt. I always get shot. I am the grenade magnet. We all know this. So when you consider all of that, right, and I've had an awful lot of fun doing that, to be honest, um, you know, it's... I think they're right for not putting it in. I think they're right for so far not putting it in. I do. I mean, I, I absorb grenades so my teammates do not have to. You could say. But anyway, I think that's pretty good. I mean, I was a little bit disappointed. <laughs> I know, I can't wait for it. There's got to be... There's, Yes, you can drive. I'll shoot. Um, here's the thing. These vehicle schematics we've been picking up at different bases. Definitely, definitely got to have something to do with it. They're not just going to allow you to unlock them. And then every everybody with a YouTube account is going to be on. Getting in there and doing it. What's that? Beville 77 Thanks for following. You know, there has to be an unlock thing for this. You can't just say, and you can just buy them in the shop. Because that will be the biggest letdown. It'll get people back in. Well, yeah, it would be good if you could configure it. But how big is this thing going to be? Is it going to be bigger than the Scarab? The Vodal Scarab? Or is it going to be just, you know, same thing, bigger gun? Did my YouTube stream drop out? I don't know. Perhaps it did. Oh, dear me. It did. It just says streamed. Great. Uh, you're right, thanks. Um, Phaser Ruddock, let me just see what I can do here, because you can do something within Streamlabs. Let's just slow down a bit so I get a bit more time. I can do something with that. Edit my stream. If I... Uh, Do that, do that, update. I don't know if that's kicked the YouTube stream back off. I don't know. I think I, I think it has gone. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know how to restream there to be honest now. Don't know how that happened. Yeah. Anyway, we'll just continue on Twitch. Sod YouTube. Um, I can always download it and then re-upload it and play it on YouTube. I suppose. Yeah, do you know what? It might have been... I mean, there's pretty windy weather over here. Ten carrier gems to Colonia. Or you'll be here this evening, then. So that's three, you're three hours away-ish. Two hours away, I would say. Thanks, Phaser Ruddock. That's, that, that's, I get it. That, that's good stuff. Thanks for letting me know. Um... Yeah, it's good. Thanks, mate. I appreciate that. This is meant to be Sky's 500 megabits per second fiber. But then, you know, crappy connections is crappy connections. 
interesting stuff. This is the Datala, the Datla institution. We can still scan some ships as we go. There is a setting on Streamlabs, I think, that I can set that it keeps retrying. Though I didn't have any drop frames. It was interesting, wasn't it? I don't know what happened there. There's no drop frames on on my Streamlabs thing, so... And the internet connection was stable. So... Who knows? That community goal was always going to be quick. Right, we're going to slow down a bit now before we get into orbital cruise. Let's just take a look. Outside of it. It is such a nice place to be, isn't it? Just look at that. Okay, we're 350 kilometers out. Here we go, we're going in. It's a good mug, that. All metal and thermal inside. Just not sure if it'll, hand, it'll handle anything in, in the dishwasher. Yeah, that's it, isn't it? I mean, just to unlock them is something. But, you know, you've got to get all the materials as well you need to, to upgrade certain aspects of the suit. And this being my second account, this second account is like... Well, you know, it's, I use it if there's something going on in a different part of the galaxy and it sees me traversing the bloody galaxy just to get you there and everywhere to get some video out. But I also noticed... 25 escape. They're a bit fruit. They'll be going. They'll be going off. Um, but I also noticed as well that I signed up for an Epic account. So I've got three versions of the game, I think. Right. No weapon zone. We get what this mission's all about. Why? Oh, I haven't got a landing pad large enough. What have I got to do here then? Secure package from Danny Williamson. Right in, Danny boy. Put the anchors on, pack the ship. Have I? Oh, brilliant. Trespass zone cleared. Hey, and we're down. It is. It hasn't stuttered at all. I mean, all right, so it dropped out. Server issue. But, you know, right. Disembarking. Got a frame drop back up to 60 straight away. Meet with Danny Williamson. Ooh, bit of gravity. Into the hab. Entering Let's see where old Danny boy is. Right. 
Right here. Hey, are you here for the pick? All wrapped up nicely for you. Don't drop it. <laughs> oh, very good. I mean, all right. It's it's a quick. Well, that's not very good, is it? Um, it's a quick win Frontier did with these, but these these missions kind of need a bit more um, complexity, right? Think there's the ship. Um, the smuggling missions, all the rest of it. Yeah, I know exactly. Playing Streamlabs is is streaming. I've got X split running, taking the background off as well. Um, and like you say, still sixty frames per second, which was the, which was what we're expecting. Now, what this is going to look like on a ten fifty, God knows, right? Other machines got a ten fifty over there. Check that out next week. See what the score's all about. Look at that terrain. You know, it is a lovely looking game. Yeah, what I'll do, I'll delete the graphics folder and, and what have you. But look at that. That is nice. It's what it is. It's nice. You know, and you say that, I'm even... There's a drop then because I put my... Um... So I'm going to copy that clip. Right, okay then. Where are we off next? Ooh, look at that. Another one. We're going to jump. I wonder, incidentally, if um, it's still streaming to Facebook. Let's have a quick look. Facebook, are we still streaming? It's thinking about it. No, it's just published. Just gonna step away for a second. Let's just slow that down.
Again, sorry about that. <clears throat> right. Let's get a bit of speed on. So my son has bought a PC like mine. He's starting his new job and, and to reward himself, he's bought himself a nice i9, 3080 graphics card, lovely marvellous. And with that, he wanted a desk, no problem. And the desk has turned up with a chip on one corner. It's one of these gaming desks, looks like it's all carbon fibre, but it's chipboard. Um, but you know, it's right on the top, so that's what he was gonna go, and that's what he wanted to show me. So, you know, we're going to contact the seller and see about sending it back. Ah. So here we are, we're coming into Ogmar B1A. And we want Poolin Military Garrison. Medium security. which I think might be fetch a personal computer. Another collection mission. Nice and easy, drop in. Nice and smooth, job done. That's a nice looking planet. Nice, nice, nice looking planet. Look at that. So, with Salvation's carrier down in the Marope system, what did we all fit out our Thargoid killing ships with? I went for the three... I got four plasma cannons. Um, Guardian plasma... Whatever they are. Weapons on there. And then a flak gun, which to be fair, I probably would need if that's going to be my interceptor killing device. Look at that. Mad. How many years have we been sat here looking at, like, beige planets, dark sky, and now it's like, ooh, it's a symphony to the eyes. So, three engineered guardian plasmas and a flat cannon. Nice. Was that class three weapons or class two? So I went for the class... I think. Which pack a heavy punch. I dare say, has it got beam laser on there as well, or are you just leaving that at the slot empty? <laughs> when are people going to work out that, you know? None of us are in. None of us are in a position to demand anything. Do you know what I mean? Oh, we demand this. You know, it's like what? Oh. Ha! It's like, oh, we the community. Oh, play the game or don't play the game. You know. It's, um, it does tickle me when I see all these, you know, open letters to Frontier and open letters to this. And it's just a vent. Fetch the item, lock a four in the habitat building. Right. There we go. Pool in military garrison. This would be a habitat over here. What have we got? 
That's the 30s. That's no good, is it? What we got here? Uh, nothing here. I'll be in the other one. You watch. I could have. I'm being lazy. I could have gone and on and looked this way. Be nothing here. That's container two. That's the atmosphere. It'll be in the other habitat. Turreted. Ooh. So we went for an AX multi cannon. I was thinking of that. Your commanders always respected the law. Get going. I did. Cheeky bastard. Him. Waldo Francis. Where are we going here? Nothing. We got round here. Where's the data pad? There it is. Yeah, I don't even think he's not doing much with Elite Dangerous at the moment. Um, it's been a while since I've spoken to him. But... Oh, ha ha! Zero, two, three, one. The personal computer. But all that stuff I could lift. And do you know what? I think I will. Oh, good God! Okay. Sorry, man. I, I was mm. it's like a Bangalore call center here. You know, I'm doing my own stuff. They're off at some sort of football fiesta, you know, kicking footballs around with the kids. Great. I'm doing this. This suits me. Thanks, Jules. Good heads up there. Cool. Right, done. Let's get launched. Well, we got local services as it happens.
what I'd expect. What about the contacts? Nothing there, really. Right. Launch. Let's go up. Right. What's next then? Anything else in this? This lovely system. Nope, we've done that. So then what we got to do is we got to get ourselves over to that one. Pennsylvania. Oh, I love it. And do some restore missions without getting shot. <laughs> I did. It's terrible. I, the carrier I was on, and I was coming to Colonia. I went out to have a look around, but do a bit of scanning, as you do. And um, of course, it left, didn't it? Shit. When am I going to find this? I'm in the middle of absolutely nowhere in a python. But um, I have made quite a bit of money, you know, with the scanning. There it is, Pennsylvania, we're off. here look that one. let's go Woo. it's a good earn when you do the colonial trip and you're scanning and of course if you can get your first footfalls as well even better you know it really is going to be something Yeah, we are pedal to the metal down. Gunship after us. Oh, following us for some reason. Four thousand meta alloys. Where the hell did you get them from? They're like rocking horse, isn't it? Yeah, I bet it cost you about a billion. I picked up a couple from some of the traders down in Maru. And, um, exactly. <laughs> now we know why there's a shortage. Simon's got them all on his carrier. Um, well, I picked up a load of other stuff as well, but I was quite astounded to see how much space all these other modules took as well, see. So, you know, a fully kitted out carrier, you're not going to have much space for your own personal cargo. Oh, here comes the rain. Here comes all the nasty weather. Woo! Cool stuff. Woo! Right. Five hundred thousand a ton. That is some heavy stuff. Schmidt. Mineralogic Enterprises. So that's going to be that one, isn't it? Schmidt Mineralogic Enterprises. Here we go. And they have made it a bit brighter, haven't they? Especially here in Colonia. Oh, 
Pull up a bit. Right. Where are we going? Right there. Ah, so that's typically when you want to get yourself in there and stock up. Belisiev's claim. Hmm, interesting. Someone was saying that there's still loads of Thargoids down in that sector. is this? It's a conflict zone. Why am I... I don't want to be there. I want to be somewhere else. Oh, good God. Yeah, I bet the price crashed. I went to the wrong base. Could, could have done some pews though, couldn't I? So new SRV, that's going to be fantastic. What I'm looking forward to, right, and they're going to have to do it. Right, there's gonna have to be a new ship, isn't it? There's gonna have to be a new ship. We had not a new ship. What was the last ship we had? Type 10. That was the last ship I think we had. Or was it the Challenger Chieftain and the other one? Chieftain, Challenger. Anyway, you know, the, was that the Alliance ships? I think it might have been them. Type 10, then it was them. Um, would another ship, though, be what we want? That's the question. Would we need another ship? Yeah, me too. Do you know you can only have a certain amount of ships you can store on your carrier? You can't stop well, off. I got to about, I think, you can store about 40 ships on your carrier, I think it is. That was a bit of a shock. I thought, oh no, what am I going to do? So I dumped some at Banders, Shinrata. That's what I did, dumped some up there. So, Bag Rani, Bag Ryani, complex. We're going to bring the power back online and rip it off for all the stuff that it's got. There it is. 
with a nice glow of the buildings. Now I don't know yet if there's anyone wandering around, so we'll have a quick look. Oh look, here comes other people. I can hear them. having a laugh. I love that cannon. Yeah, perhaps you'll think twice. Probably not though, even though I'm now wanted. Right, where's the base? There's quite a few scavengers down there. Well, there's six on the ground. I suppose I don't cock it all up now. Right. They do, don't they? They do look absolutely fab. We're going to go in, we're going to take out some commandos. Let's see how it goes, because I'm not using my normal... kicked off now, isn't it? be sending that to flip in frontier all right don't you worry 
太紧了。I don't know. I, that, that's that's annoying. Right. Here we go again. I know. Now that was a game crash. That was. That wasn't anything to do with internet or anything. That was just game instability. That was irritating. I am irritated. Never mind. That's two dropouts in an hour. Hey, cool. Um, Right, so where's the power building then? We've got three. The gra- Oh, here we go. Here they come, look. There's power over there. We could get over there just before they do. Of course, I haven't got the weapons I really wanted on this account. Or I wouldn't be bothered about that lot. Looking forward to a nice leisurely... Oh, great, yeah. Of course, there's nothing here now, is there? Might as well just go home. Then, um, optional, kill everybody. And extinguish the fires. So, this is going to be a problem. With the fires, we got data. Of course, they got rid of the data as well. There'll be nothing. Ooh, someone's shooting at me. That's not on. Entering pressurized environment. Now this would be quite a good area to... We'll turn the alarms off. There's no point looking at any of this. You know, there's nothing there. They would have ripped the data. 
authorization scan scans will keep on because they won't have authorization to get in. Atmosphere. No point going upstairs. It's all going to go wrong now, isn't it? Um, that building over there we've got to get to. Oh, they're on it, all right, isn't they? Look, they are on it. And I'm not in any fit position to go... Let's go upstairs, let's have a look. There is a fire detected, you're right. So I'm in that facility, I'm in the warehouse. I need The atmosphere. Where is it? Anti ship personnel console. Mm -hmm. Mandate port, suit recharge socket. Atmosphere processing console. That's what I want. Where is it? There. Pretty sure I've done that. Anyway, whatever. I'm stuck on something. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. That's a different building. Crazy. Crazy stuff. Of course, I'm looking for a panel. What we got here? Sample containment. Usually it's up here. I can't find it, I can't find it, I can't find it. That'll do. We're going to take him out in the SRV because that's better. Here they come. 
Here he is. There's one there. Go on, poke your head out. Shields. Thank God we got cannons on this. I think we're done. Scan up these commandos. They got bounties on them. Bounty There's going to be a few up here. Bodies have gone. Nice swanky camouflage they got though, isn't it? Pretty cool. Right. What were we doing? Have we been in here yet? This is processing. So let's see if we can find that particular item. The command center, power center, warehouse, industrial production, loading bay, ammunition, atmosphere processing console. Right, where is it? 23 meters that. Up there. Hidden. Hidden it is. Shame we couldn't loot the entire building because of that crash. We might be able to get something out of here. And we're done. Underneath as well. There's still a star. Hey, where are they getting those stars from? They destroyed my SRV.
Yeah, have it, you destroyer of SRVs. Right, I've done that. I've done that place. I've done the power. I've done that hab. Let's go do that warehouse over there. Man, that is a shame. Simon, you're still with us? Still here, good man. Uh, again, that will be wiped. There's no point in really looking at that. Which is a shame, because this would have been a good rinse, this would have, for materials. Damn you, Odyssey, and your crashes. Right, let's find a... a screen. Yeah, I'm finding it a bit of a struggle as well, lately. Get back on board and stuff of my carrier. When I've been out and about, I tend to leap, get in there just, just in time. Where's the sc need a screen? Or isn't there one? Gotta be one. Is that another cheeky bastard? Over there. There is another one. They drop more off. I mean, how many do they drop off? Right. The warehouse I want. I've done that one though. Why is the why is the warehouse come up as the command center? You know, that's, that's not what I wanted. you great but frustrating game right as long as that guy doesn't blow my ship up I'll be fine. Now, I don't want to send it away because I'm just putting out... I've got one fire to put out. Entering pressurized environment. Yeah. I thought it was. Oh, hidden. 
Hidden it is. Hidden. Leave the settlement. We haven't got to tell me twice. Where do we park the ship? There. All that lovely stuff I could have ripped off from there as well. Never mind. Who the hell is this guy down here? Being cheeky flipping monkey. Look at this. Bloody sharp shooter as well. Nearly had them all, but they must have put some more people down. Oh my god. So what's your jump range? Six. Nineteen, perhaps? So that's that one then. Next off, Fernandez Mining Base. Let's turn my lamp on. Hammer off. And I am still wanted. That's where we're going. Fernandez Mining Base. Yeah, I'm going to have to do some mission sharing as well, I think. But, um... It'll be interesting, isn't it? Once I get this back to the bubble. Thinking of what place to go tomorrow to get a decent bit of combat in on my alt account. Or my main account. With the um with the fleet carrier. Ship combat. Yeah, fancy doing just some normal ship combat. Get the Corvette out. You know, and, and blow the living daylights out of people. Ooh. Yeah, but was that on your way to, you know? 
We could do that tomorrow. Sort of break it up a bit. Oh, right, okay. I'll jump the um, the carrier down that way, anyway. Yeah. Okay, Fernandez mining base. Here it is. We're coming in a little bit warm. Let's slow down a bit. Let me know and I'll jump I'll jump down I'll jump down there. Fernandez mining base. Now I've got no SRV to back me up, but these graphics are brilliant. Okay, we're 17 clicks out. Here we go. And it's interesting that even though they are dropping the ships, those DBX ships and Vipers are dropping in um, scavengers, scavenger commandos, or commandos with a bounty, let's say that. You can't shoot those ships. Those ships are not wanted. That's why I'm wanted. Crazy, isn't it? No notoriety, mind, so not the end of the world. This is another restore power. So. Get past the guns. Here come the other ships. Let's get ourselves on the deck. And what we're going to do is sneaky beaky all the way in. Job done. Because I'm just not set up for... That was suitable terrain, come on. Disembark, here we go. How much did it cost you to get that carrier to, um, Colonia. Power. That's where we're going. 
Now they're all the way over there, so I should be able to leg it before they get over there. Get in. And light that up. See, there they are. Nice and slow. But surely, when I bring the power on, right, here. I'm being quite conservative. With my shields. Right, it should bring on the turrets and stuff like that. Energy transfer complete. Oh, great, another one that's got nothing in it. Great. Extinguish all the fires again. But at least they shouldn't be able to get in the buildings. Should. Now they've wiped a lot of stuff out. There's a lot of flickering going on. some good stuff. Building schematic. Are we going to get to have a base anytime soon? Recharge while we're here. Get into here. got data. Seven thousand of tritium. And of course all the time. Transfer complete. I right, will be got here. Oh, yes, 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 I can't pick any of it up. Oh, I can't pick some of that. Right, where's this? Bloody thing then. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Oh, damn, I don't know. Oh, I can have some of that. Right. Let's find a monitor. And find out where that atmosphere unit is. Is. So we are in the command center. Yeah, it's, it's going to take a while, isn't it? You know? Um, Fire 
Am I missing something? Well, obviously there isn't one then. Any one of these, isn't it? Oh well, okay. We're going to have to keep an eye out. It's there! My ship's been destroyed, you bastard! Just shot the ship! Ah. Well, that's just great, that is, isn't it? Apex taxis, here we come. You're doing a great job of not shooting anybody, are you? Then the power, done that. Let's go with the command. Red shirt, thanks for following. Entering pressurized environment. Bit of data. Good the transfer times have come down. Of data, isn't it? Transfer complete. Oh, well, this is just fab, isn't it? Anti personnel turrets. Great. So this is the command center. This is the dorm. There's gonna be a ton of stuff. Where's where's the bloody atmosphere sent? Fire detected. They have kind of mixed it all up on these maps. Ha-ha! Our ammo is full, which is great. Opinion polls, we'll have that. Tax records, we'll have that. Thank you very much. Oh, cheers, red shirt. Thank you very much, mate. I do appreciate that. I never expect anything like that. But it's always a nice surprise. Done that. Ooh, more propaganda. And that. And then I can't do any more. Oh, too right. Well, I hope you are entertained by all this ridiculousness that we're going on with, going on with. 
and it is it is really appreciated. Right, what are we doing? Both physicians scans got to keep them on. Turn the alarms off. Facility. Access way, habitat, habitat, warehouse. Let's do that one. Right. Go away. Stop shooting at me. Bloody power. Thing is, they can't get in because the authorization scams are good. <laughs> my streams get me away from my kids on my weekend, which is great. <laughs> but no, thanks, Jules. It's it, it's nice to know. Objective complete. Now, I've got to run away, call a taxi. Ooh, ooh, look at all that. I like how there's loads of just grenade cases laying around, you know? Live ordnance, things like that. Right. We're going to run away. We're going to call a taxi, a long range booking. Get me to bloody Colonia, quick. Good. Ooh, frames per second just dropped drastically down to 14. You see that? Now, hopefully, no one's coming. So where's this bloody shuttle? Come on. It's back up to 52 now, which isn't so bad. Like, I'm hanging around here. Shuttle Excellent. Here it is. Hurry up. Get that down here. Rick, here they come. Here they come. Come in. They're coming! There's people all the way down there. Why, why? Why are you over there? I'm over here. I called it over here. Oh, God's sake. Oh, this is going to be delightful. This is, isn't it? Right in. Fly. Welcome aboard. Thank you for coming. Yeah. Suck it. Yeah, well, I, I, I've, um, I'm not far, I'm just like two carrier jumps away from it. I went and did the Holloway um, bio thing. Um, and that was alright. Not voice active logs by any shape or form, which is a shame. Um, but you know, it was alright. It was alright. I enjoyed it. <sighs> Man, have I got one? Let the dog in. Two seconds.
So hopefully this will get me enough experience, influence, whatever, reputation. But you never know. I know that was a, a bit of an escape, but they were all wandering around elsewhere, which was okay. Right, get me to Colonia Jack Stations. I've seen, I've seen Tritium here, about 50, 52. I get where I was now. Oh, come on, Jack Station. Who is our pilot today? Well, it is this young lady with her chubby charms. Um, let's take a look. Again. She is concentrating. No sort of chit chat going on there. And then my character's not exactly sort of like, you know, probably grabbing onto the dashboard for dear life, depending on how well she's flying. It's better. All of a sudden it's got dark. That's a good animation. It's the, you know, it's the, oh, the twitch of the leg. You know? Right. We're coming in. At least the entire station came in that time. Look at the detail on that. That's at 4K. Nigh on 60 frames a second. Look at that. I saw a great effect of a reflection of the stars on these sort of solar panels on a base. And that was, I thought, ooh, pretty good. Good old Jacques Station. Is it going to land? Nobody knows. So I'm going to continue to do this. I'm going to do Colonia stuff, I think, on a Saturday. Um, I'm going to do normal bubble stuff, I think, on a Sunday. I think that's perhaps the best thing. Unless there's something major going on. There's um, well, nothing else to play. Unless Farming Simulator comes out anytime soon. I think it's the 20th of November. Um, then we'll have a go at that, I think. See how that plays. And I know nothing about it, so... Everything I've learned of farming, I've learned on Country File, which is nothing. 
And then clocks and spam. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Thank you very much. This and back. We'll go buy a ship now. Right, where are we? Over there. Go, go, go. Now, given all the lore around Jacques Station, right, I was kind of hoping that they would then set me a bit special in regards to, you know, Jacques, he's a bartender and all that sort of stuff, and he's mostly cyborg. No, same old crap. Why, why is the why is the frame anyway? Oh look at that! We've hit nine, eight frames a second. Let's just make sure. What what the hell is going on here? Um. Is that going to pick itself up anytime soon? Is there a is there a task running? No, not really. Strange, isn't it? Ten frames a second. Strange stuff. Anyway, let's see if we can hand our our stuff in. Uh, complete missions. Right. Um. I want typically reputation. Never mind the other stuff. Again, reputation. Why 15 frames per second? I just don't know. Yeah, that's it. That's all they did. It was a very rare commodity. That was it. Well, I'm friendly now, just, which should mean... something else i don't know what have you got i've got the best stock in the system nothing worth having probably sure, all the same look around same old weapons i've got like sure you've got everything more than likely Come back when you're ready i haven't got a ship um i should have because i'm friendly now Access to and I haven't. Oh, hang on, what's this now? Right. Uh no, it won't be that, won't be that. Breezer. No, it won't be that either. Um Balatanos. Um friendly reputation with the Colonia Council. Oh, that blows. Buy a ship. Do you have the time to do some transport work? If you want to know more about our ships, whatever your need, we've got the... I'm sorry. Can I rebuy my ship, please, my good man? Oh, 
Oh, no, yeah, that's 60 frames per second. Look at that. Yes, I'll have that one. Continue. Yes, please. I'll rebuy that. And everything with it. Continue. Redeploy. Um, no, I've, but, you know, through the ship I might be able to. We'll check it out now. I mean, I'm at, I'm at friendly now. Here we go. Brilliant. Let's get back in. What else could I possibly do? Interstellar factors. Oh, well, there you are. Um, right. Again, we've got transport missions. That's the Colonia Council. As you can see, I am friendly with them. Um, that's the mission for them. Let's go and set that. I mean, have they fixed it? There was a problem with them unlocking the engineers, wasn't there? Perhaps they haven't fixed it. Um, combat mission. Cleaner, cleaner limit assassination. Leslie Kane. Yeah, we'll do that. See, I don't like this. It's an illegal mission, yeah? You know, either you want me to hit them or you don't want me to hit them. Support. What do we get? We've been there. Same old stuff. What materials do we get? Maintenance, logs, knock data. Hmm. That would be nice, wouldn't it? Um... Pretty much all the same boring crap though, isn't it? You know, I, I, uh. I mean, look at the eyes on that. Yeah. What have we got going on? we got quite a few things we can do. I, I'm just going to... Do these for the materials. Nice and easy. Right. Not even going to bother with the ship. Let's take an apex. Hello. Welcome to Apex Interstellar. I want to book a shuttle. Over there. Select the drop off point. I don't know. I'll go anywhere. I'll go anywhere. Um, got loads to do. We'll do. Let me see. I don't know. That one. That's perfect. Goodbye. Have a good trip. Where is it? Come on, shuttle. With a hanger. Yeah, I mean... Yeah. Colonia Council. Hmm. Is a bit of a pain. Why is the frame shift dropped off all of a sudden? It's like... 
Like it's been going for like nearly two hours. Why now am I getting that frame rate? Machine's not doing anything. Absolutely nothing. No scans running, nothing. It's strange, isn't it? We're just waiting for clearance to approach the access corridor. Waiting for clearance, Clarence. Roger, roger. Clearance, Clarence. Watch your vector, Victor. Easiest way to do transport missions, this. Jump in an Apex taxi. Haven't got to mess about. And just call them back. Yeah, it kind of cuts into your profits a little bit. But, you know, your hands off. Your hands off. You can go and do something else that's boring instead. Should you want to. Oh, you're closing in on Colonia then, Simon. To jump. At least we can run missions next week. Which would be good. No tips for me, mate. I'm surprised that hasn't been a thing. Tip your Apex taxi to gain more candor with Apex so they'll arrive quicker. Could be a thing, couldn't it? <laughs> I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. So what are people watching on Netflix at the moment? I'm watching What They Do in the Shadows, season three. <laughs> Good old pizza. I'm watching yeah, What We Do in the Shadows season three. Seems to be quite good. I'm just waiting for the new season of stuff to come out, you know? Of course, Book of Boba Fett, December 29th. Very into that. Um You know, all all the all these programs are there to stream. You know? Now they're being trickled out. But so far what we do in the shadows has been quite good. We're about three, four episodes in. Yeah, well, I've got um, an FSD on the Python. Which is good stuff. It was a nothing community goal, this, this one. Is it thrown it out there to get people going? Mm. Unless you're going to be in to get something, what's the point? Like, unless you're going to unlock a weapon or a module or an item, kind of what's the point? It's like the Halloween thing this year as well. Right? This Holloway thing. Nothing like last year's, the whole Azimuth thing. You know, it was a bit, of, a bit damp, I thought. A bit of a letdown. I mean, it was good, but, you know, it's certain times of the year, they've all got, oh, yeah, spooky, spooky, spooky. Spooky at all. Basically, they ripped off aliens. 
didn't he? Oh, they're coming out the walls. Yeah. Look how mountainous this is. Just look at that. You know, I'm glad I'm not flying into that and trying to land a python down there. Nice and easy. Allows you to talk a little bit while you're streaming. Got to listen to this guy wittering on mind. Oh, look at that. Out the window. Right, have we landed yet? Pardon me. We're going down. Down, 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 down. Brilliant. We have landed. Fetch the item from the habitat. What wait, Commander? Come on in. I thought commanders always respected the law. Get going. Block of four in the habitat. What the? Hey! Entering pressurized environment. Downloading data. There he is. Going for a shit. Transfer complete. Just gonna stand, look at the sink. Right. Um. Four. One, seven, five, two. You. Taxi, local booking. Where are we? We want to go to the next planet. Can't go wrong, can you, with Apex? What are you doing? Go away, you and your shooter. Omnipol is the fuzz. Anything I can lift? A couple of things I could lift. They're coming in there. Yeah, it's coming in. Over there. Shuttle docked. Ready for boarding. When you have nothing like this commander does, barely a billion in the bank. And it's quite new to Odyssey. This commander. I'll take a damn anywhere you can. The Terminators. What's all Glad about? To have you on board. Is that on Netflix? Ah, yeah. Omnipol. So, yet another little taxi ride now. 
to 2v stockade. No security. And then we've got to pop over there and get that as well. And go there to the Gulag Command facility. Not bad. It's all gone quite quiet with the Star Citizen people, isn't it? I don't follow it religiously, to be perfectly honest, on what goes on with that game. Um, aloha yourself, and good morning. 2020 hindsight. Yeah, I know there's a new, there's a new version coming out. That's going to reduce everyone's key bindings to utter nothing. Um, might take a look at it, see what it's doing. Exactly, until they can save progress. There's this thing as well, as once you die, you die. You lose all your stuff. Well, when you're just starting out in a game like this, what? It's a bit harsh, isn't it? Permadeath. That's a bit, that's flipping totally harsh. But a lot of people are playing it. And it's got some good functions and, you know, it's, it's, it's quite nice. I like it. Um, I don't really think it's for me. You know? Which is strange, because this is for me. This game here is for me. Yeah, it'll be an ongoing thing, you know. But the same could be said for this game as well. Is it ever going to... It's It's cheap to get into. Yeah, it's cheap to get into. But unless you, you're willing, yeah, to buy extra ships. Exactly, Simon, you're reading my mind. You know, that's when it's getting expensive. I just can't believe the brass balls on them. Around which they're, you know, they're, they're spending on these ships. Or they're expecting people to charge, you know, charging for these ships. Shocking. I really was surprised. Some are like thousands of thousands of dollars. That's what I'm doing. I'm, I'm leaving it a couple of updates and I'll load it back up again. I mean, the last thing I saw was that city in the clouds, the rip off of Bespin. Bespin. Yeah. Adi Valen. Spot on there, mate. Tell you what, spot on. Um, it's very. What? It's because it's unfinished. Thanks for following, by the way. Touching down any moment now. Ooh, look at that. That's that's a vista, isn't it? Look at that. That's a flipping landscape and a half. Look at that. Yeah, there's a kind of a cast system going on there. I don't like that. You know. Have a nice day. I'm not prepared to go and blow hundreds of pounds or whatever on ships you know they, they can kiss it well, that's the hab how do I get in there Around. I'm just going to check you out. Bit of stutter in there. Do you see that? Bit of, bit of max headroom going on. All right, we're good. Yeah, I'm a bit... I'm, I'm on the... Really on the fence with it, to be fair. I mean, a lot of people swear by it, but... Um, Watch yourself. Shut up. Lock of five. Mm. 
medical center. Must be a, there must be another one. Look at that, I'm going to rip the data off. Duty roster, faction news, register, register. Ooh, campaign plan. Some of it might be worthless, you just never know. Look at him with his ponytail. Yeah. Right, what am I looking for? Facility. That's leisure, habitat. So it's here then. Twenty two meters that way. Okay. Hmm. Must be out there. Fair enough. Let's go and have a look. Wait, Commander. Oh, for God's sake. I thought Commanders always respected the law. Shut up. Get going. Well, where is it? 53 meters that way. I'm trying to make trouble. Oh, shut up. But it's got to be in here. Well, there's nowhere to go in here. Pressurized environment. Am I missing something? I don't, I don't know. It's definitely in that building. Well, <clears throat> okay. Go on, Try scam me again. Scam me again. Go on, I dare you. Right. Locker five. Ah, but it's here. Ha. Four, seven, six, seven. Thank you. Call Mr. Taxi Man. Right, nobody here apart from him. Okay, there it is. Board. Ripping a little bit of stuff on the way. Doesn't hurt, does it? 
the community goals with the um, delivery missions, they boost your trade rank because you make so much profit. Yeah, it, for me, it's all about distance in your frame shift drive. You want to jump further. So we're off now to another system in the same system. Kind of all happening there, then it's back to Colonia. Yeah, quite funny where all the rest of the ships are. It's quite a good distance. You know, and what's what's going on over here like, you know? Makes you wonder. Yeah, exactly. That FSD booster is a godsend. It gives you another extra 33 to 40%, doesn't it? I think it's something like that. Oh. Ulad, command facility, 86,000 light seconds away. <clears throat> Crazy stuff. Yeah, they need all size 5, don't they? FSD boosters. I think. No, it, it um, spins up faster, doesn't it? I think. Oh, come on, come on. This is just taking too long. Yep. I always go for the furthest jump, though. That's what I go for. Same with dirty drives, drive tuning. You want speed. I did engineer one for you know, clean running, the Thargoids. But I thought, no, you just want to get out of the way. 
as quickly as you possibly can. It's the same with the FSD, isn't it? It's like there are key things to do. And with some of the weapons, like with the beam laser, you want to get rid of the heat on some of them. Oh, these take so long. I'll get another cup of coffee. Back momentarily.
So is there a size six booster now? Or is that part of the community goal? Is that something I've missed? I can't remember. I don't typically jump too far with an FSD booster like that. I mean, jump a Conda, quite possibly. Ninety light years. There will be. Aha. Uh -huh. So when's that coming then? There's something I've missed. When you strip all the weapons off a ship and all the guff you don't need and Asp Explorer, DBX, they're close to 70. Here we are coming into the facility, finally. Ah, right. I see. I see. Perhaps I should have done the colonial FSD one then. Another mountainous place to land in. It certainly took a while to get here, didn't it? And people are still letting off fireworks. I mean, it was yesterday. Give it up. So here we are. Here's the command facility. We're going in. Just so you know, we'll be arriving shortly. Yes, yeah, I kind of gathered. Control, this is Apex 516 requesting docking. See? At what point are they gonna, are they gonna, uh, you know, help me out, invite me in? Ah. That's a good, that's a good jump distance for a, for a phantom. Take it easy. Right, what am I doing here? Meet with... Some in Doherty. Hey, just a minute, Mister. Hey. Look, 
Look how he saunters up with his scanner in his hand. This won't take long. Just a quick scan. Scan detected. Scan detected. None of your warrants involve us. All right, we're good. Right, well, we can wumble around you as much as we want, can't we? Um, let's see, Junior Doherty. <clears throat> let's have a look. There he is. In there, but look at it, you're 68 meters. Over there is where he is. Classic entertainment. We all have that. Local booking, where are we going next? <clears throat> Let's get all that on the go. Oh, very clandestine. Hey, you. How's it going, Commander? I've been expecting you. Yes, please take it. Excellent. Bit shifty, wasn't it? Don't you dare. None of your warrants involve us. All right, we're good. Come on. Yee. That was quick. Yeah, we need more shiftier deals. Or there's a bust going on. That's what we need. You know, it's, um... You know, at the moment, it's a bit, it's a bit lackluster. Like I said in my, my videos, it's a bit. It needs a bit more complexity, a bit more of a flow. Go here, meet this guy. He gives you this. Take it to that guy. That guy will give you something else, and take that off you. Then go over here. He'll give you something illegal. You give it to that guy. That greases the wheels a bit, and then you get something that you really need, and you take it back. Now that's worthwhile. I think, you know, otherwise it's a bit, eh. Exactly. Or it could even be, break somebody out of a penitentiary. 
shit. You know? What I don't get with this is that if nobody sees you, right, how do they know who has downloaded the data? If nobody sees you, right, they all just assume that, you know, you, there could be other people there, but it's you, right, who they're going to go after. They kind of haven't got that. If nobody sees you, then there shouldn't be any alarms. Yeah, exactly. Your suits could be made by us. Well, hang on. It's not Facebook now, is it? Meta. In indeed. It's all. It's all by all Meta. So this is the last pickup mission uh, we've gone for. Should get some materials here. Nice and easy. If you found the, the system, we're going to jump to tomorrow, Simon. With your alt account. And I'll just jump my carrier down. No, I'm on about red shirt. What it is. I'm on about when you're in a system, you do something. The alarms go off. Loads of you know it's you. They all chase you. They could be somebody else there. They should be walking around on high alert and then scan you. Ah, it's you. It's you it is. Then attack you. As opposed to just being shoot on sight. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They kind of got that, if I can say dynamic, could be a bit long. Could be a bit wrong. Yeah, we get the idea. Give somebody something, causes a reaction, even makes a change in the background simulation. Yeah. It's true though, isn't it? Players want that added bit of complexity, I reckon. I think. Or I'd want that added bit of complexity. Like, for example, pick up a stolen SRV. Drive it to this base. Let's face it, some of the bases outside, there's not even people walking around. The original ground base bases. Drive it over here and leave it. And then, got a bomb in it, detonate it. The terrorism. If it's all happening in Grand Theft Auto. Why isn't it happening here? Is that their vision? You know, take out a pirate's SRV fleet. All this sort of stuff. It, it, there's loads of things they could do. Yeah, you know, it really is. Odyssey is kind of a blank page. You know, they could they could do anything they wanted. Like, there could be a heists season where you get more complicated missions. Like, sneaking around so, you know, crouch down so no one sees you. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. 2020 hindsight. That's exactly what it is. All those old adventure games. Kid of the 70s grew up in the 80s. But all these things here add for more enriched experience. Everyone's showing their age on this stream today. I think once you get past 45 towards 50 and a little bit older than that, then you'll understand what that level of gameplay was back then. Because graphics weren't good. The story had to be fantastic to captivate you and hold you. Because typically you had a a little line of text. You enter a room. There's an airlock to your north, an airlock to your east, and a spacesuit in a chest in front of you. Perilous swamp, and there was um, quite a few text based event, loads of text based events on the spectrum. Control Apex 857, ready for docking. Arctic Adventures. Yeah. 
but it's that sort of complexity that could be written in with a narrative you know why aren't they making more use of the SRVs like I said like go steal an SRV ah. the Hobbit on the ZX Spectrum you know that would be something I'm surprised they haven't redone the game I know they've got the Stay Lord of the after. Rings online, but... Right, we're disembarking. Let's go and pick some more stuff up. Some, some dubious military personnel. Right, shooters everywhere. Meet with Molly M. There looks like there is a panel just around the corner. And there it is. Let's find old Molly M. There we are. There's Molly. Right, let's go. Where is she? 300 metres that way. Of course she is. We all are. Um, when the ZX Spectrum launched, there was a few games that launched with it. There was... Um, Night Flight was one of the first games. Basically a black screen with a hood on it. Land in the dark. Uh, and of course, Manic Miner came shortly after. But then there was a couple of text-based adventures. I think it was something like... Uh, it's like a derelict ship sort of affair. It really was... You know, quite good. And unless you had that command, there's a face for radio, isn't it? Are you here for the pickup? I am. Sure do. Stay safe out there. See that she went. I like the thing in Star Citizen where you've got the drop box. I think that's great, that is. Oh, Zork was good. Yes, now we're talking. Well, there's more to do, is it? But we've done everything. I have done everything. I just haven't finished. I just haven't left the the building, have I? Where's my colonia? Something else we haven't done yet, isn't it? Ah. Right, where's this shuttle going? Plenty of habitats knocking around. Shuttle inbound. Shuttle is inbound. Let's get in here, see what data they've got. We can in the boozer. What? <laughs> Not careful, I'll turn your atmosphere off. Normally there's data there. Whoa! Ah, oh, there is. Downloading data. Transfer complete. Warning. Dangerously low temperature detected. Leaving pressurized environment. Shuttle docked. Ready for boarding. Shuttle. 
shuttle is docked. There it is. We just gotta run our little way all the way over there. So they have a compact. I used to work for HP and then HP bought compact. I had a Spectrum, 48k one. Then an Atari ST. And then after that, it was PCs all the way. In fact, my Atari ST is still um, up the attic. It needs to be recapacitated, but it's gone. Back. Might be worth something on there. It runs, but it's running with the disc chip. I'm not even sure. I mean, someone would buy it, but. I'm not even sure if someone would. I know the Commodore 64 people were always better colour and all the rest of it. Right, so we're off to Colonia now, I think it is, for the last of the missions. Here we go, Colonia. One more pickup, back to Jacques. See where we stand. I think it's gonna be more than friendly, it's gonna be more like allied. That's what I think. There's gonna be a few more missions to do here. Rain Horticultural Nursery. Let's see what we can rip off from there. But when you think about, you know, all the computers that we've all collectively had, I still think of the ZX Spectrum. I had a fully cased keyboard. Um, and I had a box on the back called a... God knows what it was called. Anyway, it was something or other. Multi-face. No, that was the that was the interface. The um, joysticks and stuff. I had an edge connector coming out into a multi-face that I put the um, Kempson joystick in. Then the game snapshotter. Yeah, bang, the back. That was the thing back in the day. And you could basically compress it into like a hyper load um, with this. Yeah, and all the stuff you get on a three and a half inch disk drive. It's in my ST still works. It's just that I put um, a drive in it, a flash drive in it, and all of it, and loaded all the games. I it just went. Yep, it did. And if you wiggled that, the entire computer would go bang. And it's worthwhile if you haven't, any of you haven't seen it, is watching that one film, Micro Men, about Clive Sinclair. Oh, that's the stuff. Years ago, I was at a boot sale or a flea market, 
and someone was selling an old BBC Master with a hard drive, with a hard drive and all the bits and bobs. And, I, and he wanted like a tenner, right? And I went, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I, I had my daughter was in the push chair and we had nowhere to carry it. And I went, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my God, why didn't I just have it? Why didn't I just get it? <laughs> Simon, you have no luck. But that's how this stuff typically happens. I mean, you know, there's lots of Spectrum clones now. And to get a working one, you'd have to be, well, hmm. You know, I mean, they're like 41 years old. They weren't meant to last, really. But those BBCs, they were built like battleships. Just see you shortly. Passengers inbound with Apex 317. Got a landing pad for me. They're just coming into land now. There's still a lot of boot sales out now, but what people are how much people are expecting for stuff. Right? I was I was down there was a local one. Six weeks ago. Walking around there. Some guy is selling. Get this. Bowler hats, right? So my daughter goes, oh, dad, she's about 13 and everything's trained. Bowler hat. I said, what are you a bowler hat for? Anyway, wanted a bowler hat. This guy wanted a hundred pound for a bowler hat. I said, mate, I think you might be in the wrong place selling that. There's not what anybody here with a hundred pound in their pocket. And he goes, oh, no one's looked for my bone china either. Again, you might have misread where you are and what the market is. But, you know, there's always computer games and old Xboxes and stuff like that hanging around. But they're not going to go for any more than 30 quid. Right, what am I doing? Meet with Petra. Where is old Petra then? Oh, not far. Hey, you. Are you Shut here for up. the pickup? I All am. up nicely for you. Don't drop it. Let's have it. Do 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 Jack Station. Well, let's see what we can pick up on the way. No, I must... Look at that nice reflection there, look, on the solar panels. You're seeing this? Obviously, the stars, the solar panels. Shuttle inbound. Oh, it's over there, is it? We're going over there now. You can never tell. They always change. Yeah, looks like it's going over there. But there should be a mission here. Defuse bombs at settlement before they go off. Shuttle docked. 
That'd be another good one. Here are the command codes to a ship that will be parked Take at this APEX. base. Or sneak in without being seen. Get the command codes off this guy. Steal that ship. Command codes. Fly it to this dubious pirate station. That'd be another good one. Should be giving, should be writing all these down now and giving them to Frontier. But anyway, oh, to reminisce about computers past. Oh, I'm wanted everywhere, like I'm even wanted at the Colonia Council. We need the interstellar factors. Let's hope that works. And it's pouring down with rain and they're still setting off fireworks. Good grief. Must be. It is pouring down here. Pouring down. So, 2,000 light seconds, give or take, to get to Jacques Station. We're going to hand our missions in, see if that makes the blindest bit of difference. And I don't think we'd be doing it any quick if we were in our own ship. Where's that, Simon? Board. <clears throat> ah. Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, Jack Station. Oh, right, so it's how... So you're going to claim that then, I, I imagine. Get it claimed. Get it done. Yeah, so if someone's come in there, they've done a they've done a quick scan and that's the end of it, haven't they? They haven't ventured out. 
Oh, it's long like one of these. But if you want to get, you know, in with the Colonia Council, this is what you got to do. Just that this one seems to be making it an awful, taking an awful long time to do it. Way and it all came in at the same time then, which is great. Something a bit different to look at, a bit of Jack station. I'm still not sure if those fleet carriers are worth it, like, you know? They're fleet carriers. So from this system, from Colonia, like about six or seven, or eight or nine other systems in the bubble, you can buy a fleet carrier only from these systems and then kit it out with what you want in those systems. So you buy your fleet carrier for four billion, you jump it out straight away and, you know, you're going to have to find a slot to jump back in to put a weapons um, module in there or a ship buying module or a commodities market or all that sort of stuff in there, which all bumps the, the weekly cost up. So mine's running about 9 million a week or 14 million a week. Just to, just to run it without jumping. And here we are, we're finally back at good old Ajax station. And it's a good way of getting back into the station when you're wanted. A wanted individual. Okay. Mm. Take it easy. Here we go, disembark. What's the frame rate gonna hit us with now? Still at sixty. Zorgon Peterson. Some of that. Let's cash in. Complete those missions. Yeah, we want reputation. Build up good reputation with everybody. Apart from that, because I don't really need influence. Well, perhaps I do. 16 frames per second doing this. Not quite fixed, is it? Yeah. 
And that, my friends, is a local friendly reputation, that is. But Interstellar Factors is not allowing me to do anything. To clear those bounties. Well, I don't know, you say that, it's been fine on everything else. As soon as you go to that panel, yeah, I did, I did. I will do it again and see how that goes anyway. But what I'm going to do, into options, into graphics, into quality. The model draw distance is quite high. Um, terrain work is all the way over there. Look at that. Anyway, we'll have a look. We'll have a look next time. Um, okay. Back. Resume. I am going to call it a night here. Right? Um, and we'll pick it up tomorrow. And we'll do some ship-to-ship -ship combat, probably. I've been Ricardo. Thanks very much for watching, everybody. I've enjoyed that. You've kept me company. And you know what? I've enjoyed the conversation. 07, everybody. Take it easy. And hopefully it'll all work on YouTube as well. Tomorrow. Stay safe. See you soon.